Bomb Rush Cyberfunk. Try saying that shit five times fast. Bomb Rush Cyberfunk, Bomb Rush Cyberfunk, Bomb Rush Cyberfunk, Bomb Rush Cyberfunk. Okay, it's easier than I thought. It is one of those games. You know, the fun kind. The complete kind. The kind that leaves you satisfied and anticipating more from the developers. It is easily one of my favorite games to come out this year so far, and today I am going to tell you why. Firstly, let's talk about the music. Yeah, I know, you over here watching a game review and we here to discuss the soundtrack first. Crazy, right? But it honestly deserves the spotlight with how amazing a soundtrack it is. I have not run into a single miss and it's no wonder because these are the same people who made Lethal League Blaze, another game with an amazing soundtrack. And you know I need to put you onto my favorite sound in the game, which is Condensed Milk. This shit is going straight into my Spotify playlist. <laughs> The gameplay is absolutely fun and fluid. No clunk over here. You get three movement styles, rollerblades, skateboarding, and the superior vehicle, the best of all three. I will not debate with you, the bicycle. That's in my completely unbiased opinion, of course. You got a boost button to keep the momentum up. You can even boost jump, do tricks, slide, grind, grind up, grind down, grind upside down, run on walls, grind on walls. All kinds of movement options are present in this game to keep you entertained. And I could attest to that because, not going to lie, I don't mess around in games as much as I used to as a kid. Nowadays, it's usually get to the objective, progress, move on. That's the fun. But this game had such a high fun factor that I found myself just messing around and doing tricks, racking up points, beating the police. I would often find myself saying, oh yeah, I have an objective to do. Also, I want to touch on the combat, which disappointingly has the same amount of impact as an ant falling off a 10-story building. It honestly feels like I'm hitting my opponents with all the force of a snail on Xanax. This obviously isn't the main focus of the game, but if you're going to put it into the game, I have to criticize it. Like how, for example, the police have the AI of an old PS2 game being easily defeated by something just existing in front of them. They can be annoying at higher stars. For example, they'll start using chain launchers to restrict your movement or start shooting at you in the skies with these flying vehicles, but they will never be an actual threat. A matter of fact, I did not die once during this game and you should not either. Also, this game has boss fights, believe it or not. And well, the boss fights really just are bound to you running your face into the boss until the boss dies, honestly. But I digress because this isn't the reason we come to this game. Pause. The maps and landscapes that you get to explore are pretty cool in design. Over here we have the Pyramid Islands which you need to keep ascending higher and higher till you get to the top. In another, it's a mall that you could cause havoc in. This game will even have you skating in the ninth dimension sometimes. Point being, all of it looks cool and feels cool to explore. All of them are littered around with little collectibles which reward you with things like different colors, sprays and even music tracks that allow you to play whatever song you want at any given time. You could imagine which song I was playing. Story. Bro, I'm going to be real with you. The story ain't anything crazy and the lack of voice acting does not help it. But it's decent enough. I don't have anything amazing to say about it. It's honestly some dying light tear writing in my opinion, which means I will probably forget about it in about a week. It's average at best, in my opinion. It just gets the job done. In conclusion, get this game. It's peak. It reminds me of when I used to play games on my PS2. The era where so many games were just dumb fun. And that's exactly what this game is. Turn your brain off, kick back, relax, and enjoy. It.